So this is the, the Joe Biden stuff that I, I've picked up so far. Carl Fisher, delegate to this week's Democratic convention, has a bit more than a passing interest in politics. A longtime organizer, Carl's been collecting political memorabilia since before he could vote. The first item that I got was a Wayne Morse button from my aunt that she had got when she was in high school. A teacher stoked the interest. He was like, Carl, you know, you don't just have to read about elections and politics. You can collect that stuff, too. And that's just sort of opened my, my collecting bug. From Dukakis branded cigarettes to an Andrew Yang calculator, there's not much he doesn't have. There's sort of like the hunt aspect to it. Um, you were on your way to somewhere else and you see a little shop, like a secondhand store, vintage shop, and you stop in and lo and behold, there's an item that you've never seen before. And that's, that's really cool, is that somebody thought long ago enough to keep that item around that you might randomly come upon it one day. Carl stopped counting the collection some years back. It's probably somewhere in the five to 10,000 item range. He's got the Bill Clinton cola can and some Richard Nixon napkins from a different era's political mess. So what do you got here? Stuff from his uh, U.S. Senate campaigns, people who are either going to run for president, maybe, or who have been vice president or in some capacity, they're always collectible. The Kamala Harris collection, of course, is new, but the Donald Trump item predates 2016. I would wear this when he was first talking about running for president to party functions for the Democrats. And I'd, you know, like lean into somebody and say, hey, you want to see something dirty? And then I'd flip them the bottom of the tie. From Ron Wyden to Joe Biden, there are plenty of autographs and a book full of party credentials. They all had credentials of some kind. Albums of history for a two-time Democratic convention delegate, this time voting from home. Oh, it's fun. You know, I, I work in politics. Uh, it's one of those, you know, you, you work in a job where you're always around people. And so it's nice to have some sort of hobby that's still, it's political, it's history, it's Americana, but it's also very relaxing for me to get to sit down and sort through a, a basket of buttons.